everybody, welcome back to my channel, Life with Lo. Thanks so much for tuning in today. And if you're new to my channel, hi guys, my name is Lola, and I'm so happy you are here. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and be part of our family. <laughs> yes, today's video is going to be something that a lot of you have been asking me about. And I finally was like, okay, I need to get this out. Um, it is how much we paid for IVF. Yes. Yes. I'm actually going to talk about that. So if you're interested in finding out, keep on watching. You guys. So a lot of you guys know that, um, my husband and I, we had to go through IVF. Yes. It's no fun. Um, but we, we had to go through it and that was the only way that we could have our beautiful boys that we have now. But, um, with that, there's a cost, unfortunately, and that wasn't very cheap at all. Um, yeah, so that that took a huge toll on us. All of our money gone, gone, gone. But um, but yeah, so I'm gonna show. I'm gonna. I try to put everything here. Um, I probably might miss one or two things, but I'm going to try to be as blunt as I can. I'm going to just let you guys know exactly. But, um, like the first thing, um, like when I had to start this, I had to do like a million, literally, like I have here 18 types of blood work, but I think it was more than that. I had to do, uh, so many different types of blood work and insurance cover like, like 2%. Yeah, seriously. Um, I still had to pay out of pocket. It was about like $500. I had to, I had to pay for it. Um, out of pocket it was about like four to $500 that, yeah. So that's what all started. And then after that, um, the medication and everything like that, um, it was about $400 that I have to, that I had to with my own money, I had to get was about $400. I know some insurance does cover that, but mine probably cover like a hundred dollars out of it or something like that. I don't, I don't recall, but so I had to pay out of pocket. It was about like $400. The, the egg retrieval and the trans, uh, the transfer, that was like a package. And that was about twelve thousand five hundred dollars and insurance cover absolutely nothing it was zero um yes i know some states that you live in sometimes your insurance does cover but the state in pa with my insurance it did not cover one penny so yeah so about that so i had um that's one of the the price we had to pay was twelve thousand five hundred and, uh, and I said the medication was about three to $400. Um, and then uh, let's see here. I do know, um, when you test your Ambrose, there's a price for that. Um, we did not do that. Um, the doctor didn't recommend us to, to do tests, but I know that's about like $1,500 per Ambro and we had six. So yeah, I don't even want to do the calculation right now, but we didn't do it. So that was good for us. So we saved like $1,500 times six. <laughs> oh yeah. After, after the transfer, you get ultrasounds. You still have to go to your IVF doctor and insurance does not cover that. And I'll say all together, that was another $4,000 that I had to, to come up with. And so it was another four thousand dollars after transfer. You're there for till you till you graduate. Um, I was till week nine. I was I was going. So if you add it up, it adds up. So it was about like another four thousand dollars for just to check on the babies. And after that, I had to. I got. It was about like I had to get a couple boxes of extra medication. Um, that was about like $70 that I had to spend out of my, my own money. And let's see here. What else? And we have to, um, when you have Ambro left, 
and you have to pay for the storage and that is $800 a year and we already did pretty much two so 1600 1600 already we we pay for that so I'm really hoping if we do um we might do one more year I just hate um giving eight hundred dollars just eight hundred dollars like just be frozen but I know my my little Ambro is in good hands over there but that's still a lot of money and we already did two years so we might do another maybe two years of saving my my little last Ambro over there. And I'm so grateful um we got a lot of people helping and donating and uh, helping us. And we got about like 3,500 on donations and just sweet people just helping us. So that did help us um, with, you know, with time and uh, not stressing so much. But of course, we still have to stress. We still have a huge bill that we had to pay for, which we're paying little by little. We're getting there. But, but yeah, so I think I got everything covered. And then of course, when you do get pregnant, you still have that other um, insurance, especially when you have twins, it, everything is double. Everything is double. Like your ultrasound is double everything. So, so yeah. Um, okay. So adding everything up together, we have um, 500 for the, all the different types of blood work that I did. We have 12,500 12, for the egg retrieval and also the transfer. We have $400 on medication and for the meds and stuff like that. Um, $4,000 for the after the transfer, all the ultrasounds and doctor's appointment for the IVF doctor clinic only. Um, and then after that, we have $70 extra for more medication that I needed. Um, we have about $3,500 on donations. So thank you so much for everybody that donated. Um, also, we have the, the early storage for the Ambrose, which is $800 a year. So we did that twice. And I think that's pretty much it. So my total came up to $19,000. 070 and then with the $3,500 donation out of pocket was $15,570. Yes. So uh, it's a lot. It's a lot of money. Yes, it is. And um, for us to use our last Ambro, it's going to be about, I think it's going to be about like $5,000 to transfer our other Ambro so we are already starting to save for that and because we're definitely we want to use our last Ambro so yeah so that's a, a whole different story but if you're serious thinking about doing IVF definitely jot everything down um there's there's so much to it um you definitely have to be mentally prepared through to go through IVF because it's a roller coaster. It's you get emotionally. It's just it. It's a lot. Okay, it's a lot. Um, if you if you're new to my channel, I do have other videos of my IVF journey. You definitely want to check them out. I'll post them below so you guys will just see how it is. And you know, because I am going to be here for you. Um, if you have any questions, definitely um, follow me on Instagram and send me a message. I'm here to help out and also. Yeah, start saving now, you know. Um, we had, George had to take a loan out for um, for this IVF and we're so happy we have our boys. But um, yeah, we're still paying for it and we're almost done, hopefully. <laughs> and, and then after that, we're probably going to start a new one too. But um, and I'm so happy the first round worked for us and... I think that is it for my video. Um, don't forget to subscribe and be part of my family. I'm here to help you and you're helping me too. So thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And yeah, let me know what other IVF videos you guys will like to see from me because I've been through it all. And yes, that is it for this video. Thanks again so much from the bottom of my heart. Till next